Put on your dancing shoes and get ready to hit the floor for a good cause. We've got Dance Marathon on tonight's LSU Lately. Hello and welcome to LSU Lately. Now, how is our studio audience doing tonight? How are y'all? Oh, look at them. They look fantastic. My name is MJ Hernandez. I'm the host of the show, and today we've got some great guests from Dance Marathon here. They're going to tell us about their organization in a little bit and tell you why it's so important to get jiggy with it. But first, let's talk Thanksgiving. Folks, the Turkey Gorge Fest is right around the corner, and while we all love a good nap after devouring several plates of food, there's definitely some drawbacks to Thanksgiving, like having to hang out with certain family members. Some people we share blood with just make the festivities a little awkward, hostile, or just plain weird. So to save you another family argument, we've compiled a list of the top five things to avoid talking about at your family Thanksgiving dinner. Number five, Coach Les Miles. Because you're an LSU student, you're the bona fide football expert at the table. So everyone's going to want to know whether we'll have a new coach in the fall. Do yourself a favor and wait until we win another game before you offer a comment. Number four, religion. Let granny be granny and just leave spirituality off the table. Get in the spirit of stuffing instead. Number three, your personal life. Old people don't understand the intricacies of dating in the college sphere. And while you're at it, keep Tinder closed while you're there too. Now is not the time for that. Number two, thank you, I, I appreciate it. <laughs> Number two, the governor's race. No matter what, someone at the table is going to have a different opinion. To keep everyone happy, it's better to just make jokes about this chump. There he is. <laughs> Number one, your grades. We all know we're going to pull through at the end of the semester. When they ask you about your academics, just turn it around. Better yet, Annie, how's your hip? The less they know, the better. We hope these help quell the awkwardness at the table. Best of luck to you on Thanksgiving and enjoy your holiday. Now, when it comes to Dance Marathon, it's an opportunity to do two things. One, it's an opportunity for you to donate your time and money to making sure childhood cancer research is funded and that kids across the state get the health care they need. And two, it's a chance for you to show off your sweet dance moves. We wanted to check out the moves that the Tigers around campus had, and we got some good footage. We also got some bad footage, of course, but not everyone has the skills that I have, although dancing did lead to my wrist fracture. That is recovering, by the way. Anyone, check out this video right here. Hey, you guys. Uh, LSU Lately here. It's a beautiful Friday, and we feel like dancing. All right, dance, Gabe Roman. Maybe like <laughs> now shopping shopping cart. Good. You gotta get get the highest canned items up there. And then maybe a little stanky leg if you're into that. Yeah, that number is actually really nice. Oh, we can all do it. We can all do it. It's great. Um, a rope. Poof! <laughs> <laughs> not, not, not yet. Okay, as you can see, LSU has some very dancey folks out there, and uh, we'll see you next time. When we come back, Dance Marathon will sit down with us. They'll tell us how you can get involved, so stick around. Don't go anywhere. Our guests tonight are experts of philanthropy, masters of dance, and they're not going to sleep anytime soon. Please welcome Nika Corsandi and Katie Krantz. Did I pronounce that right? Yeah, that yeah, was, that was good. Very, very good. Very good. Very good. Yeah. Very good. Oh, I'm proud. Good. I'm proud. So, Nika and Katie, what exactly is Dance Marathon? 
Yeah, so Dance Marathon is an organization on LSU's campus, and what we do is we fundraise throughout the year, and it culminates in what we have, what we call the big event. Um, and all the money that we raise goes to our Lady of the Lake Children's Hospital, mm -hmm. and so it's really great to make such a difference in the state for the children. Gotcha, gotcha. And yeah. so why why is it called a marathon then? Well, the reason is because you know how you run marathons of 26.2 miles. Well, yes. Instead, yes. to make it more fun, we did a 26.2 hour event. It's the marathon. So, so to be dance. clear, you dance for 26.2 hours straight. No, you don't dance for 26.2 hours, but you stand for 26.2 hours. Okay, got it. That that's a long time. You can, do, um, I can do it. Do you, so, do you recommend a like a, a like a cardio regimen to prepare or anything like that? Yeah, um, <laughs> actually, last year we brought everyone together and we rewatched Miley Cyrus at the VMAs, and we uh -huh. intensely practiced this before okay. the event. So, okay. it's highly recommended that you do this before attending. But I mean, if you don't, you can probably. Probably get through you the entire channel thing. your inner Miley yeah, Cyrus channel, is a strategy, yeah. though. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Or maybe, Beyonce, maybe not all Taylor Swift. I mean, whatever, just pick whatever someone. you feel like it. Yeah. yeah whatever. Just Adele. Run yeah. Go okay. for it. Adele. You can do it. Adele. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And so, when is the the big event? So it is uh, next semester, March fourth and fifth. Fourth and fifth. Okay. Over that time, so you fundraise yes. all the way up until that yes. point. Okay. Got. So mm -hmm. it's a lot of work throughout the whole year then. It is, but um, it's really amazing because all the time we go to the hospital and we see the incredible difference that we're making for right. the children and for right. the entire hospital. Yeah, and we also have an awesome fundraising team. They always have stuff you can do. You can can, mm -hmm. you can do concessions. It's very easy to actually raise all okay. the money. Okay, got it, got it. And so how does someone, I mean, so students can join at any time, right? Correct. How does someone join to become a dancer? Because right? that's what they join to be, right? So how does someone mm -hmm. join? Um, so to join, you would go to lsu.edu slash dance marathon, okay. and there's a big button that says register, and it's really hard to miss. You just hit on that and follow through it. All right, yeah. awesome. And, and Okay, now, what is y'all's favorite dance move in particular? I mean, because I'm sure you show off at the big event, right? Oh, God, we have to. Uh, I mean, you know, right. yeah, in charge. Yeah, no, we do, <laughs> I, obviously. Like, yeah. um, I like the moonwalk, but I cannot do it. I pretend like I can, so. So you're just a big fan of I, watching yeah, others like, do yeah. it. Yeah, well, I mean, I like to do it, but I just, you know, it's, I just pretend enthusiast. like I can. Yeah, <laughs> like, moonwalk yeah. anything yeah. Michael Jackson, yeah. I can yeah. try. Okay, got yeah. it. Yeah. Nika, do you have a favorite? Um, I like the one where you take the shopping cart and pretend like you're oh. shopping because I'm <laughs> too poor to go real shopping. Yeah. So I think it's know. called the shopping cart. I think that is what it's called. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for that. Yeah. All right. After the break, Nika and Katie are going to come back and we're going to play a game to put their best dance moves to the test against some of our audience members. So stay with us. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back to the show. We're joined again by Nika and Katie from Dance Marathon and Gabe and Catherine here. Hello. Catherine's my little sister, by the way, from our live studio audience. Now, these two teams are going to play dance move charades. One team member is going to pick a dance move off the table, and their teammate will have to guess the dance move they're doing. The team with the most points will be known as the official dance duo of LSU Athletics. Let's put 45 Woo. seconds on the clock. Are you guys ready? We're ready. We're ready. All right, born Nika, ready. start us off. Okay. Sorry. Oh, okay. oh, go, 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 go. Ah. <laughs> okay. Oh, fake that. Oh, yeah. Go. Whip. Whip it. What? What? Oh, all right. Go, 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 No way, no way. What do we got? Yes, go. Oh, uh, oh my no. gosh. That's so what? funny. Oh, go, 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 go. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh, that's yes, yes. No, that's not one. Okay. I, this says slide on into my DM. So <laughs> <laughs> Thriller. Yes. Okay. We finally got one. Oh my gosh. Okay. Go ahead. You ripped it. Oh, the Macarena. Yes. Okay. Oh. All right. All right. We got it. We got it. YMCA. Yes. Okay. Go. <laughs> Uh, the, the the stanky leg? Yes, uh, okay, all right, that's time. We gotta call it. Y'all were just too, too qualified. It's a tie. Right, it's a tie. So now it's a tie, two to two. So both of you guys, both teams are winners. Congratulations. Let's give a round of applause. <laughs> so for playing guys, we've got all of you. LSU oh. Lately sunglasses. Come take them, come take them. Cold about these. Thank you guys tough, for tuning in. Choice, just right? remember, yeah, you can right? watch yeah. full so LSU Lately awesome. episodes and clips online at TigerTV.tv. Also, connect with us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat <laughs> at LSU Lately. I'm MJ Hernandez, and from all of us here at Tiger TV, good night. Woo! <laughs>